beautiful energy welcome into the building let us take a look at what is going on for you in your love energy um while shuffling i wasn't really picking up on anything specific but we're gonna unfold the cards in time and see what happens um, I was picking up on some sevens, maybe businesses, people like you had some type of or have relationships with. Um, let's go here. First card is the two of swords in your love energy. I'm getting, I hear proper or property or investments or shadow. I'm feeling like no weapons formed against you shall prosper. I feel like telling you that you are protective intuitively speaking. You're naturally gifted and you are in your rights, you're in your power, you're standing in your truth, right? So that's the energy. You are on the right path. Trust your divine intuition. And I'm getting someone loves you too off of this card. It is a love reading. Someone may be in between something, but I feel like they want to choose you. I hear a breast. So you're the one that they want to move toward. Or That's the energy of um, that is taking place. Someone just wants to work with you be with you in some way they want to get along with you i also feel like there could be a block toward you and this person here you could be dealing with a gemini libra aquarius you know cancerian or you're dealing with a virgo taurus i'm hearing too so earth sign and um pisces energy as well so your next card is the seven of swords with the seven of swords card i'm getting the truth so some truth and clarity coming around i hear the fame and something about your name but like i said you are protected and this is a love reading so your yeah, guilt with this energy i'm feeling like someone wants wants to take back something ill that they were saying about you like Someone did not want people to love you or believe in you or want to be with you. I'm telling you that. But I don't know for some reason this person is taking it back. They're having a change of mind. Um, Self-worth. Because you are proving yourself. And this person, they can, no matter what they do, they cannot nudge. They can't nudge or whatever. It's like... It, it's taking no effect. That's why we started out with your self word card. Um, with your protection energy. Because like someone that was like fighting against you with word or in spirit. They're realizing that they cannot take your throne or take your power. Because you're always going to love yourself. Speak highly of yourself. And impress upon others that energy too. Someone wanted to like ruin your image and something like this. Okay, so I just want you to know that. But it does not really affect you because you are a healer. You're in a constant state of working on yourself, healing yourself too. This person may have a pink hair. They and they were someone was really comparing themselves to you. Because they I feel like someone really and truly admired you deeply, genuinely, really. It's like a real true love. This could be a friend, I hear, or a social or a society. And so they, they were inspired by you, but at the same time, they, it's like they wanted to test you to see if if they really were to become you, if, would, if it would be long-lasting, and if it would really work. So they wanted to test your smart, test your spiritual gifts, test your awareness, test your love of self, test your self-worth. And now someone is seeing that it is proven. It's proven. That's the energy. Okay, and this is, this, this is someone from your past, workaholic. The world card, oh man. The world card is another energy here of success for you. You're outstanding. You could work on TV or you're a model. You're getting some type of a big break with this world card. There's something about the wind as well, picking up the wind energy. And I hear a baby in your life. I hear dreams. Does someone want it to block you? But it feels like it is over, discovery. Because you found out the truth. It could be an emperor. And this person, like a masculine energy, this person is watching you. Like, I'm also getting someone is watching over you. Like, this is an egg, or a pregnancy, or a birth. And then this emperor energy, I hear toxic um, some something, is watching over. It's like a protective energy. So... 
and so i also feel like you you are safe someone is keeping you safe going back to your protection cancer i feel like you are protected no weapons formed against you shall prosper is the energy so i hear king i just feel like your your way is made clear and i was about to say your may is way clear weighed clear you know with this confusion card but then because it, i had to prove that your way has been made clear dissipating for real let's look at this emperor card someone has strong feelings for you strong earth energy here capricorn virgo taurus I feel like this person, they watch you and they want to speak with you. But they're holding back, but they're still watching over you. You are like in a protective energy where you are protecting your energy from the world, possibly. You could be dealing with a Scorpio as well. Or you're really, you're protecting yourself. It's like you're hiding, you're in a shield, in a bubble. But this person is also protecting you. So I feel protection around you, okay? Because some I don't know why you need to be protected, like a bodyguard energy. I but I feel there is a reason why. There's something that you possess. Maybe you're you're fertile at this point. You're valuable, but someone is protecting you. Some, someone is keeping you safe. Someone is watching over you, praying over you. Okay? Do you? Uh, okay. All right. So your next card is seven of diamonds. And this is someone that is thinking about you a lot. Maybe someone that you haven't heard from. This could be like a, a past person I'm getting as well. And I'm seeing a new person too that is sad. They Like they are longing for you. They missed a connection with you. Seven. So this word is number seven important. Something about someone's birthday. Forgiveness. Someone wants forgiveness in your life to be let in to your life okay but i feel like say you are protected from this person genius uh, there's a reason why is i'm telling you there's a reason why you're protected mm -hmm. but let's move forward because that's all i keep saying wheel of fortune something about your birthday i just said it some compromising gift things are working out in your favor and i feel like it is coming and this is a love energy it is unexpected because destiny right it's uh, something is about to be fulfilled in your life and you're about to be really really happy and maybe a masculine energy knows about it cancerian and you weren't very aware that this was taking place it's like something is a gift release and i feel like this is an opportunity that's making you very happy imagine you're getting an opportunity an unexpected opportunity to travel to fly somewhere or to have something that you never knew that you would have right now. Some of you energy, it's an opportunity to speak, to declare your truth, to be heard. But you have this guardian angel figure over you that's been holding your place for you, waiting for you, watching over you, protecting you. And and you're some there's something really special about you, joy. There's something really special about you that needs to be, like, preserved. I love your energy. Right? So, you have that going on for you. The Wheel of Fortune in here is love and luck and blessings. Fortune, maybe with your money, if you're worrying about money. Or this is your confidence. You're, you may be wondering or worrying. I hear increase. Cancer about if you're if you're gonna be single or if you're gonna have someone in your life. So you could be thinking about that on your mind. And then or you're wondering if someone or something is about to show up or turn up for you. Nine of diamonds, yeah. This is the energy of being like single. You may and you're wondering if you're gonna be single independent for a long time by yourself. And but I'm seeing someone is coming in. This person here is thinking of moving toward you. They, someone is seeing you. And they're like, they're going to approach you, talk to you. and Because I'm telling you, someone wants to work alongside you. We haven't seen any heart energy yet in this love reading. This person is like strong earth sign, financially independent, self-sufficient. I hear this person could be a multi-millionaire. 
All right, this person is in positive energy, wealthy, healthy, strong, prosperous, kind, connected to the divine, naturally fertile with a green thumb. This is that person that's moving toward you. And they just, they feel so good about closing this deal or, or, or like having closeness with you. Someone is excited. Someone is positive, optimistic about being around you. Like, I'm telling you, Page of Swords, this person is watching you. They're not afraid. They're not afraid of what to say to you, how to say to you. Like, they, 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 like this clarity has come in and someone is making a move and they know for sure that they want to have these good feelings with you and close someone wants to be close to you but once again we have this protective energy of page of swords and the two of swords so you are very you're like your energy is up protected like you, you <laughs> you're shielded you're up you're ready you're like who goes there if anyone is trying to enter so I'm getting a lone and um, like a lone warrior and you just weren't expecting any love. You, you probably are kind of miserable and lonesome and you just weren't expecting like so when this person arrives, I'm sitting like you're sitting. Imagine a warrior from back in the day alone. He left his whole village and community and something was bothering him. Maybe he felt like an outcast in some way. But he was like, imagine one of those Western movies. He's living out in the desert. He has a little tent or whatever, or even a house, and he's building a fire. He's kind of dirty, sitting around a fire, grumpy, a little bit miserable. Maybe there's another word for it, but still very protective and like independent, self-sufficient, and just thinking that way right now self-aware fabulous beautiful but just not thinking about love and then someone comes hello is anybody there and he's like who goes there so it's, that's the energy i'm getting you're in you're just not expecting anyone to come up toward you with the love but there is this person that is moving toward you that has been thinking about you know i'm saying this is love but this could be work so uh, someone wants your information oh my gosh the next card is the love oh my gosh it's definitely love i'm telling you i hear twin flame so that's what i'm saying is like we were not ever expecting this the whole time it was like you what's going on in your mind what's what you're protected from what you were afraid of certain shadows your success you're moving away you're moving on moving into luck and then things end up working out in your favor like, this is unex an unexpected love that is moving toward you. Someone that you just didn't expect. But this is reminding me of some Bible story, too, where this woman, she she went up to this man, but this man wasn't, like, really in the mood for love, you know? But she went to him, and she was kind to him, and she offered him water or something like that. And then that's when he saw that he needed it. And so he, like, he started to appreciate and admire her. This could be the story of Naomi and no Naomi and Ruth, all right, something like this. But I'm telling you, this is your dreams, and this person is watching over you, like I, you know. Oh, I'm getting chills. This is for real. You're probably getting married to someone rich, wealthy, and it's and because you two have that rich, wealthy energy within you, three of three of diamonds. You are divine. You, the way you express yourself, you're just beautiful, full, fertile, vibrant, graceful. You're, for, you're truthful. You're forgiving. You're a healer. And you have someone's attention. Okay? And this person is coming to speak with you. Love. This is the truest card of love. And look at this card next. And this card says kisses. I hear kisses of wands. This I hear make believe and make dreams come true. Oh my gosh. The Ace of Diamonds fell. The Ace of Diamonds on it. New. Twin flame. I feel well. New vision. Feeling well. Okay. Someone is confident. Clear. Sure. They've been preparing. The sun card is next. Youth. You see what I'm saying? All along, there was no, like, big up, big positive energies, you know. But look at us now. And look at the card that clarifies the sun card. I love you. I love you. 
Oh my gosh, Cancer. Look at this. This is so beautiful. So maybe this energy of protection was you waiting. You were in your bubble. You were in your cocoon state. But someone was always there. Watching you. Speaking for you. Protecting you. Preparing something to come toward you. And now here they are. The sun card is someone arriving. And I'm getting youths. And I would like I'm getting babies. And, and someone coming in with notes, information. They're prepared. The Wheel of Fortune and the Sun card in your day is like so beautiful. It's like watching something so awesome in front of your face that you want to hold someone's hand. Like It's like watching something unforgettable. It, like, it's like watching a space show, something so un unreal, something so surreal. You have to like, it's like, pinch me. Am I dreaming? This is too good to be true. That's the energy that is taking place in your love energy today. It's you, you, your, 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 your heart, you like your heart will be so open, like when the sun begins to, to, to give off its shine. It, this is, you see this feeling I'm in? This is what you're going to be feeling over the moon, elated. It's like you're at a carnival and everything is for you. You're, you're at a carnival and everything is for you in your favor today. This is your birthday, is what I was saying. Everything is aligned for you. This is so beautiful. I feel so happy. I feel so grateful. I feel so in love. I feel so very thankful. Right? And you, you are beautiful as you are. You're attractive. You're magnetic. You're pulling in. You're like... Someone, and someone wants you to know that you build them up. You make them feel good. Don't worry. This is so beautiful. Someone is coming up to your standards, what your expectations. Oh my gosh. I, I don't even, I'm not even going to clarify because the cards speak for themselves. And I, I'm sure we're going to talk more about this. I love you. Take it easy out there. Hold on. This is also you were being protected divinely from toxic relationships all along if you were single. And the right person is finally here. Someone has gotten the right answer, the right words, the right everything. And they're ready to come and say, this is my offer. This is my proposal. Oh, my gosh. All right. So take it easy out there. Sun card is, the, sorry, like blessed, abundance, supreme abundance, prosperity, joy, um, new beginnings, satisfaction in your love life. We have Gemini, Leo energy. Cancerian energy on the table, a lot of earth sign, fire signs, air sign, right? Oh my gosh. All right, Wheel of Fortune, this is your day today. <sighs> and I hear you're to take a break. You're going to be feeling successful, overjoyed, like grateful, like think your things are on track, things are on, on par, you're leveling up, you're, you're feeling better, healthier, more vibrant, more blessed. Like things work out in your favor. You're, you're, you're giving thanks. Everything is to your heart's desire. I love you. Take it easy out there. Beautiful soul. You are so worthy and deserving of everything. Full joy this. And your admiration as well. Admiration for your, your beauty, your standards, your aura. And I love you again. I'll see you in the next one. All is well and all is within you. All of your show of support on this journey is massively appreciated. And all the best. Take care.